All right, Mr. Telefell TV, how's everybody doing out there? Very unfortunate news out of Atlanta via Chicago. Chicago's own G. Erbo, who spends a lot of his time in Atlanta, Georgia. He got into an altercation uh, with his baby moms. Uh, I believe she's like one of those popping Instagram figures, public figures. Her name's Ari Fletcher otherwise known as G Herbo's baby mama. Hate to hear stories like these because they involve children and obviously you never wanna see a child placed in between a very volatile and detrimental situation, but here we are. Uh, Wednesday, G Herbo was charged with battery after he had an argu argument with Ari and allegedly it turned physical. According to Atlanta police, Ari and Herbo got into it. They were mostly yelling at each other, but at some point they went from yelling at each other to Herbo assaulting her. According to Ari, uh, cops say after they got into it and it got physical, G Herbo took his son and left the location, but then he came back. Then officers spoke to Herbo when he was on the scene and when they were on the scene at the location of the alleged battery and then they arrested him for, again, simple battery. Cops say Ari had some minor scratches during the altercation, and the cops are going to continue to investigate this situation. What's interesting is, apparently G Herbo and Ari are no longer dating. This is not my expertise. I don't know who's dating who and all that, but apparently, I'm just reading the blogs here, Ari is dating Boxer, I know, I know Javante Davis. I, I watch his fights. He's on the Floyd Mayweather, Mayweather camp. He's on the money team. I know sports, y'all. I don't know who's dating who, but I know sports. And I like the I like the way Javante Davis kick it in the ring. Anywho, apparently Ari was now dating boxer Javante Davis. And she's actually 14 weeks pregnant with another child. So to add insult to injury, literally, uh, it, she's claiming, Ari's claiming that not only did Herbo put his hands on her, which is bad enough, if true, he put hands on a pregnant woman. And again, Herbo is still in jail as I make this video, or he ha if, if he's got out, there's no update that I can find uh, on like the inmate reports and all that. He's got a bond set at two grand, though, so I'm expecting him to pay that soon, and he should be out. And uh, yeah. Tuesday night, they actually were all seen. Herbo, Javante, and G Herbo, they were in Atlanta, Georgia, ironically at the same club, uh, for a Chance the Rapper birthday celebration at a club called Allure, strip, strip joint. Uh, Herbo was around Chance the Rapper, and Ari was with her man, Javante. And this comes after, a, a, a reportedly over the weekend, Herbo and Ari that were together, as they were co-parenting at their child's birthday party. A lot going on, a lot of moving parts there. A little too much for me, but we'll keep you guys up to date on this story and more. All you got to do is hit the notification, buddy. Mr. Tough is going to tell you who's dating who. Not, I'm not, but if you keep the notification, hit the notification button. I'll try to keep you guys as up to date on this story as possible. Herbo doesn't have a, a long legal rap sheet. So he'll be fine legally. You don't expect him to do a lot of time or any anything serious. He'll do some community service, most likely over a uh, simple assault. But I think the, the problem would be uh, if he committed the battery, obviously. And this Ari Chicks claiming it happened in front of their kid. As a matter of fact, she went to Instagram her story and, and described what, what happened in her words. So her side of the story, remember, there's always... Two people side of the story, then the truth. So there's three sides to every story. She said, he kicked my door down to get in my house because I wouldn't let him in. Beat the fuck out of me in front of my son. Then he took my son outside to his friends and had them drive off with my son. Hit all of my knives in my house. Broke my phone and locked me inside and beat the fuck out of me again. He choked me, punched me in my face and all over my body. Dragged me outside on the concrete by my hair after his friends drove off with my son. Took me in the house and continued beating me. He wrecked my whole house, broke all type of shit. I have a black eye. My body scraped up from being dragged outside. Bruises and cuts all over my body. Please don't speak on no old relationship play fights because this ain't that. Uh, apparently, Herbo and Ari always play fight a lot, and I knew I've seen video of Ari like you know hitting on Herbo when he does stupid shit. They used to do do little shit like that and post it on Instagram. Hey man, that play fighting shit is cool, but you know 
hey, that shit can sometimes get too serious. And this is like a situation where, man, when no play fight, if, if this is true, what she's explaining again, her side of the story, ain't nothing play about this, man. Maybe everybody should keep their hands to themselves. Because this ain't good. This ain't a good look, Herbo. This is not a good look. Thank y'all so much for the time. Let's play. I don't take it for granted. Salute. I'm out. I came from nothing, but I want everything God has for me. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I still represent the culture. I got the kids that who are now tuned in. Tuned in. Yo, we locked in right now, Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Shout out to Mr. Telefair. You're watching Mr. Telefair TV. Mr. Telefair TV? Here with the Triple B's. You can't do nothing but win.